Sometimes I just can't think and I just feel kind of like grumpy and cloudy inside and I bet that probably you felt this way sometimes too. So I've been out here hiking around and I had this moment where I just wanted to sit down with my Moldavite and just look at it. It's been a while since I really just sat down and looked at it, you know, normally I just wear them. So I sat down and grounded myself, right? And I just admiring it, just really checking it out. I'll show you, this is kind of what it looks like when you're looking at it in the right angle. See how the light goes through it? <laughs> it's so cool. So this is what I've been doing. And I forgot what it feels like because it's been so long since I've done this for whatever reason. It's like a portal into the frequency of Moldavite because everything, everything, is a vibration that is taking place on a certain kind of frequency. So I am a vibration and Moldavite is existing on a certain frequency. So when I sit here and I really connect with it, it is a portal into the frequency of Moldavite. And our vibration is able to move. Our vibration is able to shift to other things. So we can actually use Moldavite to realign ourselves with the frequency of Moldavite. So in this video, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna tell you what that frequency feels like to me, like how it feels to sit here and just really look at your Moldavite and what that kind of portal dimension is like. And then I'm gonna tell you how to do it as well as in that, why I believe that this actually works, you know, based on my opinion. <laughs> and for those of you who keep up to date with all my recent videos, you can see I am in Sedona again. It is my favorite place, as everybody's probably knowing for certain now. <laughs> I'll be here for a little while, probably. So, Moldavite gazing. What it feels like when I really just sit here and I stare at it. And it usually only takes about 30 seconds to start feeling the ship taking place. Is it feels like silence. It feels like silence and somewhat kind of peace, but it's not really peace because it's actually kind of an intense feeling. It's an intense kind of energy vibration that you're connecting to. So I wouldn't say peaceful, but it's this powerful silence and I can actually personally hear this kind of and it starts to slow down. So it's not like complete silence, but it's like all of the noise just slows down until ultimately I find myself detaching from it. And while I'm sitting here and I'm just checking out the Moldavite and I'm holding it and I'm allowing myself to connect with this vibration, I find that all kinds of information and downloads come into me, but they don't come in in the normal way that my mind is thinking. Like my person's brain, for example, um, <laughs> I'm, I'm a Gemini too, so there's like constant conversations and noise and things going on in my mind. So the downloads of information that come in, they are not the same as my thoughts. They feel different. They come from the place of the heart. They are a feeling, a sense of knowing. And for me, it's a sense of trust. That's what I get from Moldavite more than anything else is a sense of trust that like I can really just trust life and I can let go. And I've said many times in past Moldavite videos now to you guys that I believe that what Moldavite is doing is bringing us into the present moment. And I believe that that's what's taking place when I sit here and I really connect with it. It is allowing me to shift myself to the frequency of essentially the present moment. Like my true self is the present moment. So it really helps me to connect to that. And it can really just make that much of a difference throughout my day to just find myself sitting down every once in a while and just looking at my Moldavite. And I know it sounds weird, you know? <laughs> I know that crystals sound weird to a lot of people, to be honest, but you know what? It really works for me. And if this is something that might work for you too, then I suggest you try it because why, why not, you know? Why not have things that can help us to realign ourselves with our truth and trust and peace and silence? <laughs> and I found that in the past when I used to do this, I would sit there and I would do this over and over and over again. Last time I was in Sedona, I was doing this a lot too. And it really acclimates over time. It almost starts to grow. So I find myself not having to sit there and take the time to stare at my Moldavite as often to be riding that kind of frequency. It's almost like you can kind of connect to it, sit there and really look at it, and then you can put it back on as a necklace or hold it in your hand and just go about your day and just keep walking and feel 
that connection to your true self in the present moment taking place. So I really like this a lot. So how do you do this? How do you literally do this? What am I actually doing and focusing on to have this happen for me? So things work different for everybody. Here is the 100% truth about how this works for me and what I give permission to this for. So when I'm looking at my Moldavite, I personally am really paying attention to all of the grooves. I'm really looking at all of the grooves and all of the things about my Moldavite piece that make it unique. That's essentially what I'm doing. And I'll feel it with my fingers and I appreciate it. And I really love Moldavite. I really love it a lot. So for me, it's easy to become almost kind of infatuated with it in the moment. To completely just look at it and appreciate it. And usually I'm thinking about how much I love Moldavite while I'm doing it too. So note that I am giving it my love. And I believe that this is a powerful activator for anything in our lives. When we give it our attention and our love and our full energy, this is what can activate anything for us, not just Moldavite, but all aspects of our lives, I believe. So yeah, that's basically what I'm doing. I'm just sitting here and I look at the Moldavite and that's it. That's all I'm doing. I'm not thinking about, uh, you know, what I'm going to do later. I'm not thinking about the morning that I've had. Um, you know, I'm not thinking about the girl that I like. Uh, you know what I mean? It's, it's like we're just allowing these things to fall out and to find ourselves right here. So do nothing but look at your Moldavite. That's it. Just look at the Moldavite. <laughs> and you will feel the shift taking place. You will feel it. And when you can get it correctly with that light coming through like I showed you in the beginning, like this, this seems to really help with the power kind of coming in as well too. I can't 100% tell you why. I believe that it's because crystals magnify intention and I believe that light is what we truly are. We are light. So when I'm allowing light to come through this, it's magnifying who I truly am to myself, to my human meat suit, right? So this is kind of what I believe. Now, along with this, I also believe that the reason that I experienced such a powerful shift in consciousness from Moldavite when doing this, and why you can as well, is because, like I said in the beginning, everything is a kind of magical vibration, which the vibration you can think of as experience and the feeling. And the frequency is the place that the experience and the feeling play out. So think of a completely different environment and, in, sense, in a sense, atmosphere for your experience and your feeling is just how I'll explain it right now, right? <laughs> so when you are giving your full attention to Moldavite, what you are doing is you are giving your full attention to something that is completely outside of yourself. And not only that, but you're giving your attention to something that carries an inherent power and energy to it because crystals do. And because the collective believes Moldavite is so powerful, this continues to increase its power. Over time, Moldavite will become even more powerful than it is right now for all of us. Because of how much all of us are working with it and believe in it and are giving it that power, we can increase the power of Moldavite. And in the future, the future, it will be on a whole nother dimension of energy than we can even imagine right now because of what we are giving to it. It's really quite beautiful. And I'm sorry for that little tangent there, but that's just something that I think about sometimes, you know? Like, I know that every time I make a Moldavite video and I'm talking about the power of Moldavite and people see it and they get all excited about Moldavite, I know that inadvertently, because it's not my intention to do this, but I know that inadvertently I am increasing the power of Moldavite for the entire world. And that's pretty cool. And we are all doing this. We are all doing this in our own way with all things in our life that we're giving our attention to. So... <laughs> At the end of the day, why does staring at your Moldavite help you to connect to this true power of ourselves and feel this shift in consciousness? It's because we are giving our attention to a very powerful tool and frequency. It is us. Moldavite is you. You are Moldavite. That is the magic. That is the literal magic. You are the power of this because you are this. You are everything. You are the trees. You are the rocks. You are me. I am you. Literally. <laughs> Might not always feel that way, but that's because of the frequency that our vibration is taking place on. The atmosphere. 
So when you stare at Moldavite, it aligns you with a new atmosphere, so your vibration starts to change, you start to feel the different feelings, and it puts you in the atmosphere and the frequency of knowing and feeling and trusting that this really is all you. So at the end of the day, what do we have to force? What do we have to fight for? What do we have to stress about? Nothing. We can sit back, we can enjoy life, and we can trust and know that the universe has our back and that Moldavite will always be keeping you in alignment with your most powerful self. So thank you guys so much for watching. My name's Nathan, I'm realizing now I forgot to do my intro, so I'll do it right now. <laughs> Welcome to Vibes and Frequencies, I'm Nathan. I help people to be the most powerful expression of themselves. I do make three videos a week. Every Tuesday is Crystal Days. If you like Moldavite, if you like crystals, definitely make sure to subscribe. You may appreciate the other content too. The next video coming out on this upcoming Thursday is all about the most powerful time that we can peek through the veils into the higher dimension of spirituality and how to do that. So I'm pretty excited for that. I'm gonna get cracking on that video. <laughs> and I'll see you guys soon. Thanks for watching and have a good one. Bye.